gonna show you how to uh, clean up a uh, golf cart here to make it look shiny and nice. Real simple, real easy here. Yeah, as you can see, this is not too bad, but let me zoom up here a little bit. You can see the dust, kind of dusty. So the key is you want to, you don't want to scratch it when you clean it, because it sits in there over the winter. You get that dust. You zoom up, you can see it. See that dust there. I have this here. You can use this for it's a spray-on clean um, for incredible shine and protection. You can use it on your vinyl seats and uh, plastic. It's not gonna. You know how some of the wax stuff makes leave a little white re residue. This one doesn't. And you can put it on your tire too. It's a good product. Well, let's get started here. Well, let me explain here. First, thing I'm gonna do is gonna wipe it down first. Even the glass. I'm gonna wipe. Usually, I wipe down the glass first. Then I, I work around the, the paint because I don't want to scratch anything else. The plastic is a little bit tougher than the glass and the paint. So here I got uh, Dawn Ultra Platinum. This is the best Dawn soap. A couple drops and then uh, it works really good. A couple drops, very strong, powerful. You don't need much. But I have two rags here and they're all brand new. Microfiber rags. I'm gonna get them wet first, so I just get about two rags wet so I don't have to go back in and out a couple of times, you know, just get two rags wet so it makes cleaning a lot quicker and easier. So you can see I got them, got these rags wet with soap. So let them soak. Okay, I'm gonna start with the windows. Like I say, you wanna, wanna start with one streak, two, kinda like that. Now you can see, you see that dirt on there? Once you start seeing that dirt, you wanna swap aside because you want, don't wanna scratch the window. If you take Windex and do that right away, you're gonna, gonna scratch the window. So again, you see that brown? Let me take me in the sun here. And then I, again, yep, you just take that and do it one more time. And again, you don't want to, every time it gets dirty, you want to take it out. See that? Still got a little dust on there, but. And I rotate on the other side. And we're doing here the same thing here. The one, two, I usually start from the top to bottom and side of it. Because you do this, you won't get you won't get so much streak, you know. This inside is pretty clean. So look at that. See how clean that is? I might not even need wing backs. But if you do, if it leaves streak, you can use Windex, but I don't. And it depends on if you want to or not. Okay. So now, I to clean next is the paint. This is still pretty good, so I'm gonna rotate here and then, you see that? Go one round, got a little bit dirty. Two, one more here. Yeah, you see that brown? I'm gonna rotate the ins. I'm gonna fold it out and rotate the inside. Okay, I just fold it inside out here. Then go go back again here. See? Let's do that. Wipe everything down. I'm gonna do the. What you do is you clean off the dirt and you can put wax on. Once it dried up, you can put wax on it here. See, that's a little bit dirty. Okay. Now I'm going to use the other side. 
get this here. Oh, that one's a little bit dirty. So now I have the other rag. I'm gonna go ahead and start wiping down the seats here. Usually these seats have all that little fly poop on it, you know. You can see the see it and stuff and yeah, it's still pretty good. Go ahead and get it wiped down. Okay, and all the seeds are wiped wiped down and now I I get get the lights and stuff and you want the lights to be again brand new and now I get the lights make sure the rags clean you don't scratch up the light lens right and then here back okay good Check and see in here, they're pretty clean. Pretty clean. Look at that. How she shines already. And that's not even wax yet. Now I do the, the dashboard here. Just kind of swipe it down here. Get a little good wipe. Steel wheel. And the red, if the rags start getting dirty, you again. Flip inside out, right? Start again. Compartments. And then the one that's really dirty, I kind of I may use it to wipe. on the, the mats this is usually the dirtiest so I use I saved that one last and rotate and get the metal mat here down here, here, look at that. Look at the dirt. You get a lot of dirt, I usually kind of go it out a little bit. See how dirty that is. So you just rinse these off really good. Put some more Dawn soap in there and rinse it off until you get all that dirt off. Or you can get, you know, you can get new rag for the rims, up to you. My rags weren't that dirty, so I went ahead and rinse it off. And I'm gonna use them again for the for rims. The two rags clean up. Again, they weren't that dirty, so I'm gonna use them again for the tires and the wheels, rims. You can see pretty clean. So what I do is I start from the inside. And again, I'm looking at the rag. If it starts to turn brown or dirt on it, I I use the other side and you want to get in everywhere around you start from inside that's how I I do it I start from the inside out see Let's start on the next wheel the tire I'll do the layer here but Next wheel here, inside out. Again, you don't want to make sure it's not brown. If it starts getting a brown dirt on it, you are scratch it. So you see it's starting to brown up a little bit. I'm going to use this side. Give me teen. Now I'm going to rotate the other side because it's starting to get dirty here. The rack is. Okay. So now I'm just gonna give that rim a good wipe here. You see that? 
around. Do all to all four wheels. See the dirt on that. Also want to see your see everything in here it's clean. If it's not clean, wipe it down of course. It looks pretty good. Oh, there's a little mud here. Let's wipe it down. A little mud, but not much. Check your shocks and everything, make sure it's clean. Looks pretty good. Check the back too here. Fenders. It's a little bit white here. Okay, so now got another new microfiber rag here. I'm gonna apply the ceramic spray coating on. The direction it says to spray it and just wipe it on. And say it lasts about six months to a year but oh it says to apply two coatings here. And just wipe it on. And say it lasts about six months to a year, but oh, it says to apply two coatings here. Let's get it really wet. Wipe it down. I usually give it about two wipes here. Two coatings, what I do. But you see why you wipe down the golf cart first, then you, you apply this ceramic coating because the rack doesn't get dirty and you're not also not um, getting scratching up the golf cart so what I do is do I apply over the paint first because this ceramic coating you can, uh, you can put on plastic too and it's not gonna make it white like some uh, some ceramic cone does. So now I'm gonna swap the other side. Use the other side of the rag. And just wipe. And look at that, look at her shine. Okay. And every time I wipe, I spray another coat on it a couple more times. I usually do it twice, two coats. And it dries off and it's supposed to protect your paint. Which uh, this is probably the second year I had this golf cart and it's it works pretty good. It does get a really good shine. I'm gonna put the side again and spray some more. Get this front another coat here. And now I'm gonna wipe all the plastic in the vinyl seat. You see that? You see that gloss? That's kind of what you want. Helps protect from the sun. See that little shine gloss to it? Here. See how I, uh, right here. A good example, that's what you want. All over the plastic. So it can protect it, protect from the sun. The sun is very powerful. It can, uh, this, of course, you all know the sun is very powerful. It can destroy stuff really quick. Apply it on there, it gets a little more color. Of 
play on this side on the dashboard here. Yeah. Let's do a little nice, a little some some life to the plastic, you know. Sometimes the plastic gets a little bit old here. And it makes it shiny. You can put on the metal too. Doesn't hurt, right? Okay, now you're gonna do the rims and the tires. Give it a little spray here. Do the rims here. Inside out, that's why I do. Look at how it look at how it shines. Look at that. You can tell a difference. Makes a big difference, huh? Yep, that's the one without, that's the rim without the ceramic cone, that's the rim with the ceramic cone. Well, how much more it shines. Let's apply this to, also to this rim here. Makes a big difference. Yeah, I love this stuff. It's Stuff's awesome. So I spray it and then I just wipe the rim down. You can see that. And it works on rim too. I mean, and it works on tire also. You see the difference? Yeah. See how it evaporates in the, the sun here. Okay. Spray. So that's how you wash your golf cart, okay, without using a hose. Real simple, real easy. Just wipe it down, wax it. But that's how I like to do it. Instead of taking a hose, spraying it down. Then you get all your battery equipment all dirty and everything, you know. But I also check. We come in here a little bit. Also want to check the battery, make sure it's clean. You know, there's no buildup. And then when you spray wash it, also you get, you can get the battery uh, wet and damage it. Okay. Until next time. Adios.